Are you having a hard time concentrating when you read books? Do you find yourself going back over lines that you've already read or sometimes even full paragraphs because you realize you just skipped it and just kind of read over it without noticing? Uh, do you have a tough time getting yourself to pick up books or to go back to them once you've stopped reading them for a while? Well, I have pretty much the solution for you and it took me quite a while to find it until I really started binging books recently for about four or five hours a day and I found myself in the same situation like I would start a lot of books and I would just not finish them and I would stop in the middle I would you know maybe read a couple of lines and just not want to read them and it just became really exhausting to always kind of try to ha having to force myself to read and the solution that I found is quite simple. Read what really interests you at that moment. Now, I know it sounds simple, but remember, reading is not like getting educated in school. You don't have a certain curriculum that you have to follow. There are no must-read books. You're reading for yourself, and there's a, an inner part of you that you might not be consciously aware of but it's there that knows what are you currently interested in what are you currently dealing with what even what mood you currently are in and sometimes I'm in a mood to read something very dark and very uh, kind of uh, hard to digest like the Gulag Archipelago uh, by Solzhenitsky and sometimes I'm in a very kind of like exploratory mood so I'd like to just pick up 10 books and see which one is the most uh, kind of like energetically just feels good at that moment where I don't want to put it down and whenever I'm in a reading session and I sit down for a few hours to read my main goal is to get into that mood where I just don't want to drop the book and that's how you know you kind of hit the golden spot and you might think no 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 I don't agree with this there's this one book that I must read and I know I should read it but the problem is when you read and you don't enjoy reading and you don't have that feeling where you just don't want to put the book down, you're going to forget most of what you read, if not everything, because your brain kind of looks at it like this experience that it wants to forget. You know, every time you go through something that's not a good experience, what your brain does is condense it and fog it away and just try to like get rid of the memory and you know just keep the, the good memories if it can. So you don't really you don't really want to remember things that you didn't enjoy, uh, but if you read a really good book, or it doesn't even have to be the book that's good, just the part that you're reading is really interesting, you're just gonna drown in it. You're gonna think about it later. You're gonna ask yourself what happens later, or what's the next thing you're gonna learn, and your brain is gonna assimilate it into the brain machine. But again, if you read something that's not interesting, you're going to miss a lot of the details, you're going to miss a lot of the context, uh, you're going to miss data that, you're sh that is shown, you're going to skip names a bit, like, you're not going to be there, and uh, it's going to go away. <laughs> so, maybe you will keep some of the knowledge you gain, but, but definitely not at the same rate that you could if you just enjoyed uh, the thing that you're reading. So... This is my tip for you, and I highly recommend that you apply it and see how it works for you. Just treat every single reading session as you attempting to reach that point where you don't want to put the book down. And keep changing books, maybe even skipping forward or backwards in books. Just keep doing it until you hit that spot where you're like, oh, this seems interesting. And then you start reading and it's actually interesting. You just don't want to stop and you're going to have a much better time reading books and what you do read will be a lot more deeply instilled in your brain. So that's my tip for you for today and go ahead and read a book today if you haven't yet. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't and also feel free to go on a free one-time coaching call with me. I'd love to help you. See you soon.